is going on people welcome back happy mother's day to all you mothers out there i'm actually recording this on mother's day so it won't air until tomorrow morning but uh a little belated that's fine right regardless uh, i think we can I was debating on reinstalling all this stuff but pretty sure i can nab this this is awful. This one is at least normal, so we might as well keep it. And I think we'll just deconstruct this thing. It's right in my way. Uh, we do need to remove roofs before I get a little overly ambitious on that. So let's get that. There we go. And remove floors as well. Alright, that'll get that mess cleaned up. Quest done. I have the floors put in over here. Some different colored blocks than what I used on the first one. Anybody have any magic skills? Oh, our hunting hats are getting done. Fail the thrumbo chase. That's nice. Pain. Magic. Oh, we can learn teleport or shadow. Creates a shadow aura that periodically buffs somebody. Eh, we're not really good. Mass teleport. This one we need a master scroll for. All right, let's go with this one. So, I don't know. We'll just start souping that one up over here. We have, oh, be nice to get some more of these powers. Overdrive automatically causes damage to mechanized systems and sabotage overrides, fail safes, mechanical stuff. This actually looks like it'd be really good against mechanoids as well. It is intriguing. Let's uh, let's keep kicking on the offensive protocol here. All right, looks like they did finish this room. That bed's a masterwork, so we're gonna go ahead and install it in here. I'm not a big fan of the fact that it's not the same material, but that's just gonna have to be okay. So we'll just make the furniture in this room out of regular wood. Since I refuse to have <laughs> mixed material bedrooms. Huh? Okay, and hopefully paint's not greedy or something. No, okay, good. We do need to get some plants taken out here. It's pretty stinking cold outside at... 5 Fahrenheit, negative 15 Celsius, but indoors, as long as they're not open in the doors, it's hovering in the mid-60s. Yeah, which is, what, 17, 18 Celsius, so we should be all right on that. We're making some meals. We are a little short on meat once again. Don't have that many pawns, so I don't need to freak out about it too much. <clears throat> Somehow, despite it being the dead of winter, these berries haven't rotted here. We can hunt some of these small animals. Alright, so this is Payne's room. There you go. And next, what do we have for blocks? We did black and green, and we did cream tones. And we can do black and pink. Alright, they are really going <laughs> nuts with that shit. <laughs> All right, we have 72 cyanide. Can we get some more of those brought over here? Don't need to go too stupid here. There we go. All right, we'll see what they come up with for that. I keep getting that gong sound. I'm not used to the royalty music. <laughs> nice and toasty in here. I guess we have two heaters. I'm surprised they're not working on that yet. So let's go check the wildlife tab. Well, there's plenty of bunnies, but... Oh, there's goats. Well, they might be leaving the map. <laughs> They're like, mm, seems like they might be hunting us. All right, there's our last trapper hat made. Shoobs, you can put one on or not as you see fit. I'm going to rip up all this wooden floor. We don't want to get too nuts. With... Oh, look at that. They're almost done. Let's get this tree chopped out. It's right in my way, although we have a shit ton of wood laying around already. Brit's salvation. Brit joins. There's an unknown threat. And I can't see Brit's stats. So, not terribly inclined to go try and rescue Brit because 
Might have done too much hunting. <laughs> Just kill him and run off. Ouch, these dudes are harsh, man. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck me, man. <laughs> these things will die before morning, and then uh, that'll be that. I just have to remember that they're down there somewhere. It's hard on this map to see anything. I get that complaint with the old world forest that I made for the Beastmen in my Rimhammer mod. But it's like, if you don't want to deal with it, then don't play the fucking, <laughs> don't play on that map. It's pretty straightforward, right? Yeah, this one's going to perish. What is it? It is 5 a.m. Maybe somebody will come down here to hunt it. Maybe not. Half an hour till death. Did they already hunt all the other ones out? That was pretty stinking fast. Whoa, I <laughs> love that. Man, I like that automatic spell. That is so great. All right, so we're gonna have to consider what we wanna do for floors in this room. I really like the slate. It stands out nicely against all the other types of stone that we have, so. Okay, so the other goats are somewhere else. This is all wood, so I'm just going to leave it for now. Yeah, I really like this mod that adds lots of different types of stone. Look at this shit. Ah, come on. Uh, clear all, and we want items. That's under manufactured, actually. <laughs> I do that every time. So, mortar shells. There you go. Let's get these put away. I'm a little... Stun baton. Oh, that sounds pretty cool. Little miffed that we got attacked as strongly as early as we did. Okay, we do have some here. Just gonna burn this fucking forest down in a hurry, but we'll be building out of stone. Where did all my constructors go? I guess they're cooking and making blocks now and butchering. So once we get the bedrooms done, I'll take care of this area and get it presentable. It's such a nightmare right now. There's probably a lot of animals laying around that the predators have killed, but good luck finding them all in this mess. I wish we had more water, too. Is this water? No, it's mud. I wonder if I can fish up there. <clears throat> I don't really like the idea of doing it that far away, though. I don't see why you can't make a fishing zone overlap deep water, but... All right, Emily's almost done with this room, and then we'll get a nice bedroom set made for there. Actually, we don't even need this fourth bedroom yet, so... Green's got a good steel bed. Normal stuff otherwise. I guess we'll keep the bed. I know I said I wouldn't mix material in the bedrooms in terms of what things are made out of, but... That one's slightly impressive. That one's slightly impressive. I could add another nightstand in here. It's probably fine, right? Do we have a shitload of steel? Uh, not a shitload, but we have a decent amount. At some point, we'll be craving it, though. So I think I'll hold off and not make it out of... Not make bedroom furniture out of steel when we have so much wood around. And plus, these are normal. Mm, I don't know. I'm not sold. Did we run out of blocks? No. I guess we'll just go ahead and move her in there now. There's no good way to get the layout for a single bed in here, but there you go anyways. And I think we'll build a copy of that there. There we go. And this we can reinstall over here. Anything else in there? She's just a heater. Didn't look like we're going to need that down there, so I think we'll just uninstall this for now. The batteries have stayed fully charged almost all the time. Doesn't tell me the quality of this room, but that's alright. I want to get a bunch of this work done, so I should stop putting things in. And I'd also like to sort out this floor. That looks really cool. Those two combos of color look good. Maybe I could do something similar with slate and green stones over here. All right, and then this bed needs to be assigned to green. And it turned out slightly impressive at a 56. This one made it to 57 with the new nightstand. These ones have heaters, so they'll be a little boosted. Oh, so Shubes has some new magic skills. Repair protocol, sure, why not? 
try and max it out to get the most power that we can out of the ones we have. Construction level 11. And then we're going to focus on this mess. I think I'm going to move these walls so I can actually smooth these two. <laughs> Maybe we'll start making a proper perimeter. So I don't want to get too far in without some proper security. Maybe I'll just string the granite across the back. Like if we block this off and run it across here as best we can. I did see some more granite over here indeed. Can I select all those? I can just go get a claim order and get all that. This little bastard can deconstruct. I'd like to have enough granite to block and double all this. Oh, what was that? This one I moved? Yeah, okay. I just have to hit the reinstall button. Oh, God, that spell is awesome. I love that she jumps around like that. I can't get enough of it. Ugh, oh, keep doing that. I'm going to go ahead and move all these blocks. All right, I'll also put the door in back there for now. It's a granite door, so it's stronger than most. So we'll probably end up having to use a different material in the front, and that's just fine. We just scavenged all that granite off the map. Eventually, we have to crack into this. I don't want to make the mistake and grow as fast as I did last time, though. That was not such a good idea. I think that was partial. What? Huh? Is it in here? Nope, we never fucking filled all that. You had to be shitting me. Alright, how are we gonna deal with this now? <laughs> Let's go in there and then we'll hold both of these open and get everybody to run up. We're gonna lose some shit, but oh, everybody better be selected here. That's Alright, here they come. Move your asses, people. <laughs> Alright, uh, where is Pain with the magic missile? Let's blow that on this. U3, focus fire on that. Did you just magic missile the wrong fucking one? No. You just can't see the damn thing where it's at. You guys better start going nuts on this dude. All right. Down it goes. Time to fucking run, people. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Are they breaking shit? Ah, oh, they're destroying my batteries in there. Somebody just has a nuts gun. I don't know who it is. Let's see. I have no idea what's doing that. Yet another medieval tournament. Alright. Keep shooting it. Alright. I think it was Shoobs. Oh, I think it's this little dude that hangs out with him there that's doing that. That's pretty cool, at least, huh? Totally worth it. Offensive protocol. Oh, Shoobs finally got caught. Is there one over there? Yeah. Alright, let's make a break this way. We need to go rescue our stuff. At least they don't start fires like the other a-holes do. And next priority, obviously, filling this in. I totally fucking spaced it. Been a very long day. All right, and then batteries. So that's gonna be under power. And let's put these in their final spot because at some point they are gonna have to run power up there, which is gonna be ugly in the short term. But we'll have to rework things at some point. All right, there you go. Don't want these held open anymore. A lot of cleaning. We have no batteries. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> uh, somebody could finish these things off, I guess. I should probably make a zone to dump. Wait, let's try and butcher those dudes and see if we get anything special for that. Yeah, we're butchering all animals. There might be chitin with one of these mods. And are we going to stick them bastards here as well? Let's go double check and make sure. Corpses. Animal. Insect. There you go. Get them brought in. Let's see if we can get some chitin. <laughs> uh, there's still one here that needs finishing. And hopefully they don't start doing something with the insect meat. 
I swear to God, they should. Oh, they're cooking instead of butchering right now. All animal corpses will get butchered. Let's disallow insect meat in here, though. I don't think we want to do anything with that. So raw food, meat. What is that? Raw fish. Interesting. Since I can't freaking fish on this map, I want insects. Let's just let these guys do their thing. There you go. If I don't get chitin, then next time we'll just dump them wherever they end up. And you constructors could start making fucking batteries <laughs> any minute now. <laughs> we should probably get rid of these wood floors too. They're going to be a liability at some point. I can 100% guarantee it. Yeah, I saw no chitin come out of that. Maybe from the big ones we'll get chitin. That just looks like a bunch of insect meat. Well, that's too bad. All right, well, let's dump those things over here. I guess hopefully that's the last infestation we have, but we uh, we may not. We <laughs> we will definitely get them on other spots on this map, considering all the caves that are around. All right, that was the meat. Yes, the corpses are here. Then look at all this stuff. Greater minion corpses. I'm gonna gonna be intrigued to see what all that's about. Insect corpses. There you go. This clearly the batteries weren't built. Who's my constructor? I'm just gonna force that to happen right away. Emily, get up and work on this. Emily, are we breaking this? I'm gonna have to allow those chunks here because otherwise they're just gonna sit in there and take up space. Uh, for God's sake, so many corpses here. All right, shrink that down. Okay, yeah, any chunks. Let's get those dragged out. And we're out of juice. <laughs> What's Emily doing? Emily, stop doing that and come build this battery. Thank you. Let's double check our power situation and make sure it makes it over there. It, it does. There you go. All right, we'll get there. And they're working on finishing this last room, which we don't really need now, but I'll probably put a double bed and just finish it out so that if, if we get a prisoner, we're, we're all set for them. And done. It's got to be one of my... Uh, don't put that there. That's way too consistent with where all the other batteries. <laughs> we're going to mix it up. One of my favorite things is getting to be... doing cool things with the floors in every single bedroom. <laughs> uh, I mean, dirty insect bastards, man. It really chaps my ass that they did that. It's my own fault, right? And then I go and say we're going to fill it in, and then I don't actually fill it in. So there you go. We'll get it done. We have all the material literally sitting right there. All right, so we ended up with a good double bed. This room is at 58. Fantastic. Yeah, see, there you go. Lickety split. They're going to have nowhere to put all this stuff. That's the next problem. <laughs> I'm going to just go ahead and finish this and then forbid it so that I can... Ah, for God's sake, I can't do it. <laughs> what a hassle. There you go. Uh, so we have blocks in here. Can be hauled out. Are we putting steel out here? Where's our steel? It's inside. All right, so we can actually put other stuff out here, like raw resources. Why don't we just make this preferred? And all this meat needs to be shrunk down. Holy shit! All right, raw resources. So this is already set up properly. So we just have to wait for them to actually haul this stuff out here. We probably should start researching so we can get. Space traders coming in. Expand there. And this room is not going to be pretty, but there you go. Get all this stuff hauled out. And the batteries are now almost fully charged, so we're doing just fine once again. And we have some delicious insect jelly to boot. Worth eight bucks a pop. Holy shit. Hopefully they're not eating that. Why did they stop constructing? <laughs> oh, Emily's asleep. Sounds about right. Well, cheers to all my patrons once again. 
Captain Rogel, George, Resock, Arkin, Invictus, Zazzle, Mike Ferrero, Natasia, Lazarus, Arkinix, Doug Meyer, Scaves, Adam Shosnowski, Patrick Johnson, Sebastian Schaefer, Dimitri Rurik, Garrett, Chew on Disc, Excelsior, Cobra Samurai, Viking Brandon. Game is locked up. Tyron X, Typhios. Keeping Homer. We don't really need a necklace. Three troopers will be placed under our control. Feed and house them, but they may die. Wait. Oh, it's a rhino. Hmm. Interest. Oh, two mech clusters. Man, we are getting some tough quests. I was hoping that, like, it sucks to lose a plasma sword, but, like, if it, I think that might have been one of the reasons our wealth was so high. Let's see. We're at about, what's, where's most of it's got to be these, dude? No, that's items. What, what happened here? <laughs> Uh, what the shit happened there? What do we have that's worth so much? I'm not really sure. We had something come in all at once that caused a major problem. This is probably the plasma sword going here. It wasn't the raid. Yeah, I have no idea what the hell could have caused that. Anyways, Alexander, Michael Rickshaw, Dirtle, Dave, Cornell, Bodar, Jed, Davin, Resden, and Thomas K. Thank you guys very much for your support. It means a lot. All right, we can get this next batch of these allowed. These animal skins aren't worth anything. Let's, oh, this is going down because of the light that's in here. All right, that should be the last of it, right? That should not happen again. <laughs> now we can grow up here too once we block all this off. So regardless, I have no idea. Maybe this redwood shit's worth a lot. There's sequoia wood, 156. That is definitely not what caused me to have. I went from what, 13, um, 13 and a half thousand. Oh, there's a trader here to over fucking 20,000, like 21, just over 21 K. So something's worth like eight grand. I checked their gear. There's nothing obvious. Uh, Emily's my talker here. Go talk to these dudes. Get out of bed. <laughs> Maybe we can sell some shit. Maybe, uh, we can sell all this. Hopefully we don't run out of food. They do have a cougar and an otter. We don't want those. Incendiary shells, uranium, plasteel, magicite's not really worth anything. Interesting. A gem of acceleration allows you to enchant an item. Decreases cooldown. Interesting. Aesthetic nose. Cool. <laughs> Finally a fix for the fucking nose issue, man. There's Archmage robes. <laughs> uh, worth a fair bit, but I don't think we have that. Let's see. Mage spell, arcane bolt. Does this mean any mage can learn this? Teaches a magic user. Huh. Ice spell. That specifically teaches an ice. So I think any mage can probably use this. I'm going to try it. I might regret that. But I was curious as I am to see how this gem of acceleration works. I think I'm going to skip for now. I'm going to sell the magicite just to get rid of it. So we'll just buy the arcane bolt. All right. So then Payne already has a magic missile. So Shubes, where the hell is it? There it is. Read. All right, there you go. He's got an arcane bolt. Badass, dude. Well, please leave a like if you're enjoying. Uh, that it's expired. Leave a comment. I do read them all. I do respond. I think next time what I'll do is get a proper base area laid out. I'll probably have to deconstruct these and put them elsewhere. Like, If I could finish this wall, we could pop a few of them in here. I can also do some mining back here. And I don't know why I was putting them over here. <laughs> I'll just reinstall this one over there. And what is this? This is all slate. Yeah, we're not going to have enough granite. We should have enough to finish this. That's just a guess. If not, we'll have to improvise with something else. And if I reinstall this wall and I reinstall this wall, 
They should be able to get those things smooth before too long if they don't go to bed. It's only 11 a.m. Emily. Let's get these smooth before the insects show up again. Alright, Payne has a deeper understanding of magic. So, oh, they've left me a gift. Adding 400 transportation cap capacity. So at some point, we'll be able to like transport around the map, it looks like. Where is their gift? Hopefully it's something... Oh, silver. Well, thanks, dudes. Much appreciated. And then let's get these put back where they belong before I have any problems with that. That's like super tedium getting to a point where you're fucking taking out walls to do smoothing. Oh, now we have a slaver after we just spent all of our damn money, but here we are. We could grow a little, but I'm not taking any mediocre pawns. Let's claim and deconstruct this. Any beds that aren't total shit? No. I mean, one of them is normal, but... Ah, <laughs> uh, you're meditating. Go talk to that, bro. Uh, maybe we can move this tree out from right in front of our door, too. Alright, uh, you only want to buy incendiary shells, so we're not... Well, actually, we can afford these people. They have three badgers. <laughs> Alright, so let's check out low. Health is good. Chemical interest and industrious. Chemical interest... I think that one's okay. Uh, yeah, abstaining from drugs leads to negative mood issues. I'm gonna let that person go. Undergrounder and Tycoon. Has an eye for silver and a tongue made for it. They believe their products are the best products and will likely convince you if you give them a chance. They get 25% trade price improvement. That's fucking awesome. Huh. Interesting. All right, if I was going to buy that, dude, what would I have to sell? That's tough, man. But that still leaves me with eight. I think I'll do it. You know what? We have the stuff, and why not commit to a little bit of growth here before the end of the episode? All right, I should have probably saw what this person could do before I committed, right? <laughs> it was actually not too bad. So I have more crafting skills but also works with plants so if we have somebody doing growing well we already actually have that covered but oh well <laughs> we need a weapon for you my friend what do you do you're more of a melee person but we don't actually have a melee oh we don't have shit for weapons frontier pistol versus a hunting rifle i guess we'll go with a hunting rifle solar flare fantastic well, on that note thank you guys for watching i'll s oh, what the hell was that Ah, there's a bed. It's awful. Never mind. I'll see you guys next time.